campaign, a courtesy call to Mayor Patricia Chase Green's office recently, U.S. Chief of Mission to Guyana, Terry Steele Gonzalez, said the offer to repair the clock is a 50th anniversary gift to Guyana. Well, we, we as the U.S. Embassy and the U.S. government believe that Starbrook uh, Market and Starbrook Clock is a representation not just of Georgetown, but of Guyana uh, as a whole. And it, is, it was a real privilege and, um, and it's going to be a challenge uh, to make sure that the clock um, uh, is back to its original glory and at perfect timing of the 50th anniversary uh, of independence of, of the country of Guyana. And we, uh, we are very pleased to be able to help in its celebration and to return the clock to its original uh, glory. The Starbrook Market Clock has been out of commission since the 1990s. When it was up and running, it reminded those nearby in their offices, those on the road, or a few miles away about the time. Mayor Chase Green said she is very happy that the U.S. Embassy has decided to help the city's historic market show peace. The mayor proposes a timeline for the completion of the Starbrook Market Clock. Well, as you know, it has been a project that has been ongoing. We've had the previous discussions. We're at the point where it's coming to finality. And I would like to see this project completed by the end of December 31st. So for the new year, we can ring in the new year with the chimes of the new clock. Um, I am grateful. I want to say thank you to the U.S. government and its people for coming forward and assisting the country and Guyana as a whole as in spending thousands of dollars for the rehabilitation of the Sabbath market. Yes. It's a great um, project and we're happy that at long last that project will be completed. Asked for a cost to complete the project, Gonzalez said. The, uh, it's, it's several tens of thousands of dollars uh, that the project uh, will, will amount to at the end of the day. And, uh, and it shows the real commitment, uh, not just of the U.S. government, but of the U.S. people and, it, and our friendship with the Guyanese people to make such an investment. The Starbrook Market was designed and constructed by the Edge Moore Iron Company of Delaware, USA over the period 1880 to 1881. Construction of the iron and steel structure was completed in 1881 and may be the oldest structure still in use in the city. The Starbrook Market was designed by an American engineer, Nathaniel McKay. The Starbrook Market covers an area of about 80,000 square feet. Andrew Weeks reporting for Safe TV2 Headline News.